Welcome to the Mobile Device Management Guide by 42 Gears. We'll start by answering the question, what is mobile device management, also known as MDM. Then we'll compare three of the most commonly used terms in the industry, MDM, EMM, and UEM. Next, we'll ask what can an MDM solution do and consider how MDM works. We'll continue to consider what an MDM solution can manage before reviewing how MDM helps manage devices throughout the entire lifecycle. We'll finish up by looking at the deployment methods you can choose from and consider how to find the best MDM solution for your needs. All right, let's get started. Who needs MDM and why? MDM technology is more important now than ever before. Workers worldwide are increasingly going mobile and mobile devices have become crucial to all kinds of jobs. Businesses need ways to manage, monitor, and secure these devices. An MDM solution lets you improve many aspects of your organization at once, instead of making improvements one by one. Still, it's important to ask, what is mobile device management? Mobile device management is the approach used by companies to remotely monitor, manage, and secure devices of all kinds including, but not limited to, mobile devices. MDM can manage more than mobile devices. You can use MDM technology to manage smartphones, tablets, desktops, and almost any other technology, also called an endpoint. This is why the term Unified Endpoint Management, UEM, is more accurate. MDM, EMM, and UEM are the three most common terms you will see when researching MDM solutions. It's essential to understand that these terms have evolved over time. The term mobile device management came first, followed by enterprise mobility management, and finally unified endpoint management. Mobile device management, MDM, is used to monitor, manage, control, and secure all workplace mobile devices. The term is a holdover from an era where cell phones didn't interface with any other devices in the office. As a result, IT teams focused on managing office-owned phones separately from other devices. The term Enterprise Mobility Management, EMM, represents managing mobile devices, applications, and content. EMM includes Mobile Device Management, MDM, Mobile Application Management, MAM, and Mobile Content Management, MCM. Importantly, EMM also includes the ability to manage both company-owned and employee-owned phones. The term Unified Endpoint Management, UEM, reflects the strategy of using a single management framework to manage all kinds of business endpoints or devices. This includes phones, tablets, computers, Internet of Things, or IoT devices and much more across a range of operating systems. This is far more convenient than previous approaches and also far more powerful. As mentioned before, modern MDM solutions can manage almost every kind of business device, also called an endpoint. This is why the term Unified Endpoint Management, UEM, is more accurate. When researching an MDM solution, ask what types of devices and what operating systems the solution supports. Some solutions only support one operating system on a given type of device. For example, they might only support iPhones. This means it's important to find a solution that fits your particular needs. Depending on the MDM solution you choose, you will be able to manage mobile phones, both classic flip phones and smartphones, tablets, including both standard tablets and rugged ones, computers, including both desktops and laptop computers, wearables, including smartwatches and rugged wearables, virtual reality headsets, industrial Internet of Things, or IIoT devices, including sensors and routers, and non-traditional endpoints that normally aren't considered manageable, such as printers, scanners, and battery cradles. Mobile device management can help in dozens of ways, organized in a few larger categories. These include MDM, mobile device management. These are features that impact the entire device and everything on it, such as setting up and monitoring many devices at once, applying contextual policies, 
and remotely troubleshooting devices. MAM, Mobile Application Management. MAM features manage specific apps rather than controlling the way the entire device works. MCM, Mobile Content Management. The purpose of mobile content management is to manage files and other contents with a focus on protecting sensitive data. MIM, Mobile Identity Management. These features control how devices access your network, providing safeguards against attacks. Bring your own device, BYOD. You can use an MDM solution to create a virtual workspace on employee-owned devices without invading personal privacy. Non-traditional endpoint support. You can use 42 Gears Things Management technology to manage equipment that wasn't designed with manageability in mind, such as printers. While it is essential to understand the general concepts underlying MDM, this is only the first step towards actually implementing it for your business. You will need to plan for the entire device lifecycle, which can be analyzed as a sequence of five steps. These include Enrollment, bringing newly acquired devices into your business network. Provisioning, setting up initial configuration, security settings, apps, and content for employees and users to get started. Deployment, getting provisioned devices in workers' hands. Management, monitoring devices for compliance, pushing app updates, and troubleshooting application and performance issues. Retirement, removing devices from the system once they reach end of life, or EOL. When setting up an MDM solution, clients must choose between two deployment methods. The first is cloud-based. In a cloud-hosted MDM solution deployment, the provider who runs the MDM solution hosts data on external platforms such as Google Cloud. Cloud-hosted MDM solutions are a good choice for anyone looking for a straightforward way to quickly set up an MDM solution. The second is an on-premise deployment. In an on-premise deployment, an MDM solution provider leases its software for use on a client's own servers. This means that the client is now fully responsible for maintaining and protecting the MDM architecture with all the challenges that that creates. On-premise MDM solutions are ideal for companies that need to keep all data in-house, provided that they have time and money to spare. There are a few steps you need to follow to make sure you choose the best MDM solution for your needs. First, identify your overall goals, such as improving worker productivity by a certain amount. Then, catalog all of the endpoints that you need to manage. This includes mobile devices, computers, Internet of Things devices, and anything else you have on hand. Figure out your budget and the staff you can devote to the task. This way, you can choose a solution that your business can afford in terms of time and money. Will you be providing employees with devices or asking them to use their own? Plus, do you want to operate MDM through the cloud or on-premise? Next, assign roles and tasks to all staff involved. If staff are accountable, they will deal with these issues more quickly. Finally, consider what makes your business unique. This could be your location, your product, or anything else. For more information, consult the full ultimate guide to mobile device management here using the link below. Thank you for watching and best of luck with your MDM deployments.